passing uh, beam uh, Mount Kilimanjaro on the right side, so passengers on the right side can have a beautiful view of the mountain. <laughs> How are you feeling? Oh, I'm in my feels really. I feel like crying. Oh. Long time what, is, what is a what is a trip like this mean to you? I don't know. Like generational differences, you know? Um No one in my family's ever done something like this. I've never done something like this. We've trained so hard for this. It's here. It's real. It's weird looking at the airport and the plane behind us and I don't know how many hours we've been flying and we're tired and hungry. Well, okay, not hungry. The food was great on the plane. <laughs> but we're about to make a difference. It's good. It's fun. It is a wonderful morning. This is the first day of the start of the Stratum Mandela Expedition 2023. This is the August group. That's why I've got all of them being ladies. Well, there are a couple of men being us. But this is the gate where it starts. We are at the Marangu gate. We've done most of the formalities. This is where we meet our crew, being the support guides and, and porters. Then this is where it starts. So all that has been happening as preparations is out. This is the real deal. So this is the first day of this expedition. Uh, my name is Sina Tracy Moyani. I am from South Africa. I run the Track for Mandela program under the Imbumba Foundation and we are here because we are attempting to reach the highest peak in Africa on Women's Day the 9th of August 2022. Essentially we started Track for Mandela in 2012 um, after Mr. Richard Mabasso, our founder and CEO, overheard a fearful conversation about menstruation and realized the stigmas and misconceptions associated with it. So he then decided to create the Caring for Girls program, which to date has helped 1.5 million girls across South Africa and neighboring countries. Um, and he established Track for Mandela to create more awareness and funding for the Caring for Girls program. Um, it was a Mandela Day initiative, and over the years we've extended it uh, to have more than one expedition uh, per year uh, to honor different uh, days that are significant to, to our country. Jumbo. Jumbo Buana. How about you, Gani? Okay, keep going, keep going. Jumbo means is hello. How are you? How are you doing? Hakuna Matata means no worries. We're so happy to have this climb and then that. And then we're going to feed our kids, you know, because of the people coming to life here. What we have from here just to solve our problems, feeding our kids in schools, treatment, which is good for us. Pushing through, so it's not too good, not too good at all, but the body's still taking it up, so yeah, taking it a day at a time. We have arrived at our second uh, overnight camp. We will be here for two nights. This is called Horombo at 3,700 meters, which means we means we've just gained about another 900 or 1,000 meter ascent. The reason we'll be here for two nights is because we, we've we come up so quickly, we need to stay here and rest and acclimatize a little bit. I think for me yesterday, I've reflected a lot on the people who are helping us. Um, and how they are doing what they're doing because they have to, but also in doing what they're doing, they do it with their 100%. They just show up 100% in, in everything. We did what we call a climatization climb or we'll hike or an active rest day where you climb a little bit to gain just a few hundred meters before we're uh, above from where we stayed last night just to try and trick ourselves that we are climatized. Birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Happy birthday. I've got a new family now in Tanzania. Um, you know, the new family in track for Mandela. And it's just been such a special day, a very hard day. And on my birthday, we'll be waking up at about 10 p.m. to go up this mountain. So it's going to be extremely tough. But I think that 
the effort that everyone's already gone to to make this, spe this day special for me, like I just owe it to everyone to at least, you know, give it a good effort as well. Tonight, it's not about that guy that will be coming to support you as well. This is your mountain. This is what you came here to do. We don't fish anymore. What I'm saying it is, this is your time to step up to the plate and fight your way to the top. We will be there helping, assisting, but there's nothing more than what we've done to get you here in these conditions that you are in. So what I'm saying it is, yours I go away I look at people and I see opportunity I see the potential I see everything but that can't happen if you don't believe in yourself if you don't believe you can do this it will never happen this is the time you need to reflect on your why beyond Trek for Mandela and caring for girls this is the time to walk that personal journey to up there. I personally believe in you. I believe you can do this. I know it will take toil, sweat and agony. But at the end, if you fight, you will all get to the top. I'm not